Hi Cancer, welcome to your tarot readings by Roxby. This is going to be your January 2022 tarot reading. Happy New Year, everyone. Really, it's going to be a great year for everyone. 2022. Cancer, those of you that have recently subscribed, I want to say thank you so, so much. Absolutely appreciate that. If you're not subscribed to the channel, but you like what you see, please do hit the red subscribe, hit all notifications, so you get notified when I go live. I do the live readings, the weeklies, and um, yeah, everything. You'll get notified of everything I do. Okay, Cancer. January 2022 for Cancer. I am using the beautiful Thelema. Star in the back. Oh, Empress on the front. Beautiful deck. Cancer. Oh my God. None flipped up. Cancer. Your cards are absolutely amazing. They feel amazing. Now. Okay, Cancer. Here we go. Two of Wands. Planning, maybe making a decision, waiting on a decision. Wow, Ace of Wands. Hermit, sign of Virgo. Death, sign of Scorpio. Five of Pentacles. The Sun. Page of Wands. Queen of Pentacles. Overall Energy, Six of Swords. Nice. Bottom of the deck, Seven of Wands. You are feeling passionate, energetic. You're definitely, definitely not backing down. Absolutely not backing down. And you're not quitting. You're fighting for your rights or a situation. You know, with the Six of Swords, you're moving forward. You're transitioning, really, from shitty times to much more calmer, better, peaceful time. Peace of mind. Like, this is probably one hell of a fight. But you are moving forward. What makes you happy is you have the Two of Wands and the Ace of Wands right next to each other. You absolutely have a passionate new beginning here. That's very exciting. This could be like a new job. Ace of Wands really is an exciting new adventure. 
a new relationship that will be very passionate. Very passionate. You know, a new business. Whatever it is that you're very passionate about. You know, with this Two of Wands, actually... I feel like you're you're very focused on this. Literally, it's is lingering planning mode with both cards, and you just have about you know you're ready to start down out on a new path. You know, you're figuring things out. You're getting excited. You have a world of possibilities here, Cancer. Literally, it's in the palm of your hands. It's amazing energy. For those of you that, you know, are starting something new, you know, I do feel like this is a very, very early stages of this. You know, what I feel with the Seven of Wands, you know, that you really did have to fight for this. Or, or not even back down, not compromise. It's something that you're definitely very passionate about. I do feel for many of you that this is job related. It could be a business that you're starting. It's something that you've thought about deeply and honestly with the Hermit here. I do feel for many of you that this is like a new business that you're starting or a job that you landed. I truly feel like this is something that you were spiritually guided towards. You know, because the Hermit really is a spiritual energy, guys. It, it, he is. You know, some of you could have spent some time alone figure, figuring all this out, uh, planning. Some of you might have to travel for this new beginning. You know, with the Ace of Wands, really, and the Sun... Some of you definitely might need to travel for this new job. Or if you're moving to a new home, you definitely could be moving to like a warmer place. Five of Pentacles. You know, for some, for some of you, you could be experiencing some financial hardship, overworked and underpaid. But I feel like you're healing from that. You really are. With the Ace of Wands, especially if it's a new beginning. A new business. A new job. It's a new beginning that is really going to help you. Like you're absolutely moving towards some kind of success. And the sun, I mean, come on. Sun... It's happiness. Complete cons consent. It's a new beginning that you're starting. That's leading you to happiness. It is. Absolutely, Cancer. Leading you to happiness. And very much being sp spiritually guided to do even if it has something to... That... <laughs> How do I want to say this? Even if, it's been, even if it has been something that's been ongoing, keep on going with it. Like, don't back down. But with this energy, you're definitely not keep... You're not going to keep moving forward. Because you were on an amazing path here. The Page of Wands, it represents a new adventure. But I do feel here that the, it's exciting communication that you have been waiting on in regards to this. 
and with the hermit definitely seeking that enlightenment clarity answers you know as far as timelines you know when is this going to happen you're absolutely gaining enlightenment you know the answer i would say the first two weeks things are being highlighted to you like you're getting what you need to move forward and with the death card here it represents endings and new beginnings Especially for those of you that are changing jobs, moving to a new home. That's the ending of one thing in your life and opening up the space for an, a new beginning to come in. A big changes coming in. And you also have the Queen of Pentacles. So again, I feel for some of you, this is really job related. Some of you could be so. Some of you could be dealing with a Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This could be someone that you've been waiting to hear from, with the Hermit. She definitely could be a Virgo. I really feel like you're waiting for this person with every ending. There's a new beginning. And you're waiting to start that new beginning. This is really a, a very exciting one. And again, something that you're very passionate about. very passionate about all right let's look at this five of pentacles because um i definitely want to see like the after tarot like this could go out a while depending on what it is it definitely goes out longer than this but um it is it is a great i mean if you've had a reading with me Cancer, you could definitely leave a comment how great these this deck is, how accurate the reading is. It's just an amazing, amazing deck. Cancer. just literally fell out um like what's the hermit gonna help do all right that card fell right out and that's how i deal now let's, let's see here first well you definitely are receiving exciting good news I saw that with the Page of Wands, and now the Knight of Wands. This could happen fast, quick, unexpectedly, surprising you. Oh my God, and the Ace of Pentacles, on oh, this Five of Pentacles. Listen, if this has to do at work, I really feel like you are saving money, and that's why, like, you're saving for this new business, a new a new home. Definitely dishing out a lot of cash to make this happen. I mean, really. That's it. That's all you need. The sun is making this happen. I'm pulling you an oracle card. Magical times. Beautiful. It's a great deck. Okay. For Cancer. Okay. 
I need to move up. Cancer. Cancer. Well, okay. I take what gets thrown out. So we got two. You got two, Cancer. You got two. Oh my God, change. You are going through big changes early, especially with the death card here. Absolutely. You are transforming. Let go of the past. Embrace the light and the joy of this new day. Girl, you might be saving your money for that. Because with the Five of Pentacles, I, you know, that's someone that, that does sometimes come as, feels sad, lonely, depressed on the outside. If that's been you, don't give up because this is amazing energy. This Ace of Pentacles is amazing. And reconciliation. Remember the source of love. A loving action is all you need to begin with the process. Reach out with a simple first step. If there's someone that you want back here, like a Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, Cap, Cap, I would say Virgo, go for it. Go for it. Whether you're male or female, I don't care. Go for it. Definitely. You, you have a lot of amazing energy here. Don't give up. This is amazing. It, it is. Don't give up. Keep fighting for what it is that you're wishing and hoping for. Seriously, don't give up. Don't give up. Great reading, Cancer. Absolutely love you guys. And I will see you back here soon. Bye.